<gasps> Hello everybody, it's Juice here. Welcome back to some more Undertale Blind. Um, things happened. Um, I came to the realization I actually missed something with the piano, so I'm gonna try to go back for that. Um, let's see, status... It's been a while since I played this game. Um, I think it was like a week since I played this game. And I wanted to try to let you guys have a chance to um, catch up on any tips, that, anything I missed. Um, let's see, someone said I can actually just kind of go all the way back. But it does not seem to be working in this case. Well, I guess I can. It's just going to be a while to watch. I should have just done this in the first place. I'm sorry, guys. Um, you know, I don't feel like going through that puzzle again. <laughs> so um, I'm just going to go ahead and go back to... I'm undying. I'm very sorry, guys. If I miss something, I apologize. That's why I kind of regretted, like, rec recording, like, a bunch of episodes that, um, one night. Um, but, um, yeah, I'm probably gonna record a bunch more tonight, because, like I said, um, this game, once I play it, it's just, it just keeps me hooked, man. I'm not sure why. It's just, the story itself is just like, ooh. Alright. Oh. Let's save. I'm assuming I'm gonna fight Undying right now, so. Oh. Hello. Uh, you look, uh, stunning. No more running away! Here I come! Alright. What? I mean, guard. Undyne attacks. Um, I changed color. How about I check? Undyne attack 58, 12. Defense 20. The heroine that never gives up. As long as you're green, you can't escape. Unless you learn to face dang danger head on. You will not last a second against me. Oh. Okay. So it's like this. Okay. Heroically towards the sky. Am I is my thing unplugged? No, okay. Gotta make sure it's um plugged in. Okay, let's see. I think I'm good on health for now. I've gotta have this thing on. Not bad. How about this? Okay. I think I'm getting the hang of it. I'm sure it's gonna get harder though. For years we jumped to a happy ending. You are getting a happy ending. I'm gonna go back home and you guys go home with me, I guess. I don't know. I should have read what that said, I'm sorry guys. And now sunlight is just within our reach. Yeah, but you don't have to kill me to to do it. I don't think that's correct. And Dime Bounce is impatient. Damn. I won't let you snatch it away from us. But what if I just want to go, I just want to go home, like, I'm not sure why it's so hard to understand me going home. Enough warming up. That's you warming up. Let's get your DDR. Oh, shit. Okay. So she just changes my color randomly. Okay. I'm not sure why, but the arrows rhyme with just DDR in general. I'm not sure why. You're tough. Oh, I can still move. Okay. Oh my goodness, but your spears, don't you touch me! Okay. Lift your spear impatiently. Just looking at her face, just. Ugh. Even if I could beat you. Oh, ouch. Sorry, didn't mean to do that. And I can't move again. Of course, her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Nah, uh, I don't want that. 64. No human has ever made it past Asgore. Who's Asgore? The name sounds so familiar, but I... N I... Ugh. Like I said, I know some of the characters. I just don't know what they... How they relate to each other. Well, the only thing that I, that I knew before this LP started is that... The Pirates and Stans are brothers, so... That's the only thing I knew. It's 63. Oh god. This is getting a bit difficult. Don't tower over me, threatening the girl. You don't want that. Girl? So stop being so damn resilient. Oh, she looks angry. Oh, shit. My bad. I'm assuming it would be better if I played with the, um... Control... With the direction pad. I'm playing with, like, a joystick. Probably might change that in a bit. What the hell are you humans made out of? Um, determination? I think that's what we're made out of, I guess. I don't know. Maybe it's blood, too. And Dine holds her fist in front of her and shakes her head. Why are you shaking your head in front of... Okay, whatever. Anyone else would be dead by now. Well, you haven't banked on me coming in here, have you? I don't... Damn, what the fuck? 
The wind is howling. Yep, it's sure howling. Um, a lot of people are asking me what my favorite character in the game is so far, and I honestly think that's gonna be Papyrus. Like he's so. Ooh, that wasn't that looked that looked a little bit weird, so I kind of stood there. Um, we'll see. But yeah, I think Papyrus is my favorite because he likes puzzles. I like puzzles. Oh, they're tricking. Oh, they're tricking me out. Flower pollen drifts in front of you. Uh, I think I'm good for one more, then I'll heal the next round. But I'm determined to. I, mean, I don't think I ran into a character that I actually dislike. Ooh, that was weird. Okay, let's heal. Let's see, I have a snow piece. I don't want to eat that. Hmm, Astro food, crab apple, CT. What's this? HP was maxed out. Aw. Determined to eat this right now. Yes, you are determined to end that right now. Oh, those marks are going to trick me up. Damn. But, um, yeah, Papyrus is my favorite. My second favorite? Uh, I don't think I've met all the characters yet, have I? It looks like a low cast. I mean, Stance is pretty cool, too. I wouldn't say he's... Well, nah, he's a jokester. Right now! Girl, you stop that. The spears pause for a moment. What spears? Get out of here! Haha! -ha. So she's like a abandoned here. Oh. Okay. Flower pollen dress. So she's supposed to be like a abandoned hero or something? Die already! No, I'm not gonna die. Girl, you I know you don't want me to die. Okay. Oh, that was not supposed to happen. But at least I got the hang of that a little bit. 59. You're getting in my way. You don't want to try to kill me. Excuse you. How about you stop being a little bitch? Let's see, Reddit Rider wishes around you. <laughs> Can I actually flee from this battle? I'm gonna do it. I'm slowing me down now. Run! <laughs> Dude, run! <laughs> Damn! Stop running away! Damn, did I just reset the battle? Can I do it again? Escaped. Bye! No! <laughs> Stop following me! Come back here, you little punk! Uh, I'm gonna keep doing it. <laughs> it's just funny. Ring. Hey, what's up? A papyrus. Um, wrong time, honey. I was just thinking, you, me, and Undyne should all hang out sometime. I think you would make a great pals. Let's meet up at her house later. She's kind of in the middle of kicking, trying to kick my ass. Bye! <laughs> I just left! Oh, he's sleeping. Bye! <laughs> I can't believe the game just allowed me to run away. Oh shit! Strike it. R run! What am I doing? Armor, so hot. But I can't give up. <laughs> she just died! She looks dry. A water cooler. Take a cup of water. Oh, do I give it to her? Oh, I just poured it all over her. <laughs> um, what's gonna happen now? <laughs> what is she doing? What's up, girl? Oh, she left. Hmm. Stans was there. Welcome to Hotland. Okay, I guess we're in Hotland now. Um. Oh yeah, someone told me to change the dynamic because they were bored of the all black thing. Um. Whoa, that wasn't there before. Oh, k k k k k. I was thirsty, so I came over for a waterfall to get a drink. You want? I can give you a drink. Are you carrying that just looks sophisticated? Because it's not working. Can I drink it? Eh, whatever. The water evaporated from the heat. It's cooked by rate too. Okay. Let's see, just say. Okay. Um. I thought it was. I kind of thought it was funny how I just left without any, um. 
a laboratory. Hang on. What do these two do? Dot dot dot. Sorry, Undyne, like, told us there was totally a human in the area, so, like, us royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Yeah, even if the elevators work anyway, we will do our best, Miss Undate. Um, I just spared her, I guess. I kind of wanted to kill her, but I, fir I saw Flea and I thought it wouldn't be an option. Let's see, what? Whoa, I got a stalker. It's you, it's me. Can't go up these. Is there trash? It's too dark to see what's near the wall. Is it? Oh, wait, because she, he, he or she, wh whatever gender this guy is, uh, it's in the, it's in the dark. Let's see, can I open the fridge? It's too dark to see near the walls. It's too dark to see near the walls, okay. I'm just gonna go. Whoa. Whoa, who's this? Hello. Oh, my god. I didn't expect you to show up so soon. I haven't showered. Ew. I'm barely dressed. Ew. And it's all messy and... What's up, girl? I'm assuming it's a girl because she has eyelashes. Um... Hi. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist. But, uh, I'm not one of those bad guys. Are you sure about that? Because everyone who's with Asgore is like, eee, you must die because you have skin. Actually, since you stepped out of the few ruins, I've, um, been observing your journey through my console. Ew. Your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on a screen really makes you root for them. Oh, uh, I guess I can understand that. So, uh, now I want to help you. Hmm. Should I trust her? Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through the hot land. I know a way right to Asgore's castle, no problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a teeny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robot TV star or something. Anyways, recently I decided to make him more useful. You know, just someone's small fractal adjustments. Like, um, anti-human anti combat feature. This bitch. Of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so. Oh my god, girl. And, um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood? <sighs> you tried to help, but you know what? You tried to help. That's all that matters, I guess. <laughs> but, um, hopefully we won't run into him. So can I leave? Oh. Did you hear something? It's not him, is it? Oh god. No. Oh no. Really? I'm gonna go to- Oh yes! I don't know who that is. Welcome, beauties. Oh. Today's quiz show. Oh boy, I can already tell it's going to be a great show. Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant. I guess I'm the contestant. Never played before, gorgeous. No problem, it's simple. There is only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die. Of course. Metaton Tex. Um, why is Alphys there? I think that's her name, right? I've only seen her like once, and I needed some time to remember. Let's see, Minotaur attacks. Let's see, check. Minotaur attack 30, defense 255. His mental by ridge in involvement towards. Oh man. Let's start with the easy one. What's the answer? What's the prize ranching correctly? Oh. Oh, she's helping me. Okay. Alright, uh, can I cry? Here's your terrific prize. What's the king's full name? Let's see. Let's see. Asgore Dreamer. The music's actually pretty uh weird, but I like it. Enough about you, let's talk about me. Okay. What are robots made out of? Too easy for you, huh? 
ships and snails? So she's hoping me give me the answers. So I just gotta look at her for a bit. Uh Okay. <laughs> I like how she I like how he's not even noticing that she's just helping me. Don't count your victory. How many flies are in this jar? There you go. Congrats, congrats, you're so lucky today. Check. I don't want to know what happened if I get it wrong, so I'm not going to. Let's play a memory game. What monster is this? It's a frog, right? What? That's not... That wasn't it. Okay. I guess... I, good thing I looked at Alpha Eyes. But can you get this one? Would you smooch a ghost? Great answer, I love it. I don't think she didn't give me an answer, so I can just pick one. Metatonic cat Here's a simple one. How many letters are in a Metaton? Oh my goodness. Okay. I didn't the the numbers were still going, so I didn't fucking understand. Time to break out the big guns. What is Mimi's favorite food? Oh! Oh, I know this one! It's snail ice cream! In the fourth chapter, everyone goes to the beach, and she buys ice cream for all of her friends, but it's snail flavor, and the only one who wants it. It's one of the favorite parts of the game, because it's actually a very powerful message about friendship, and... Alphys, Alphys, Alphys. You aren't helping our kitchen, are you? Oh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question. You will be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphys have a crush on? Hmm, she's not giving me the answer this time, so, uh... I have, do I have really have 30 seconds? Um... I have a feeling it's supposed to be me, but... Um... Do I, do I die if I get it wrong? Do I just say don't know? Um... I'm gonna say me. Seriously? My my, how conceited can you get? I love it! And while you are completely wrong, you deserve some credit. I've seen her watch you on her computer screen, smiling when you succeed, shrieking when you fail- Did I fail? And always, always whispering, No, wrong, you have to go that way! Okay, that's- So, she's basically you guys, I guess. In its own way, it's not- Is it not love? Well, well, well. With Dr. Alphys helping you- She's not helping me, though. The show has no direct tension. We cannot go on like this, but, but, this was just a pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance, more bullshit. Until next time, darlings. I'm not sure why I keep not giving my robot voice. Well, that was certainly something. Uh, sh I thank you for helping me, darling. It's a half bag empty of dog food. Who's eating the dog food here? Wait, wait. What? Let me give you my phone number. Again? Then, then maybe, if you could, if you need help, I could... What? Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient! Toro gave it to me. It doesn't even have, like, texting. W wait a second, please. Did you just take my phone? What? Here, I created it for you. It can do texting, items, it even got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. Now we're officially friends. <laughs> I'm going to the bathroom. Hmm. She upgraded my phone. Whoa, what's this? Can I still call Toro? That's my favorite part. How about Paris? What's up? A lab? My brother would love that. He loves science fiction, especially when it's real. Science fiction is not real, but okay. Let's see, dimensional box A. Oh, so it has. Oh, so it has. Okay, so it's basically a box I can just carry. Okay, that's nice. This doesn't have anything. Okay. The beta figure is a female human with cat ears. Oh, well, it's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Seeing seems like notes or something, but it's all written in chicken and scratch. It seems like walk through to a game or something. Garbage can, but it's pretty cute. How's a garbage can? Let's check this out. Here's a video feed of your location. Just 
she's just locating me everywhere I go, huh? That's not weird. Can I go in here? The space between the walls is only a few feet wide. Can I go in the bathroom with you? Yellow feet are tapping just beyond the door. It's a bathroom sign. Okay. Let's see, scientific books these seem very dusty. All the books are labeled human history. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot finding a beautiful alien princess. This does not strike you as very accurate. No, it does not. VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons, they are all labeled human history. All these books are labeled human history. You look inside a book, it's a comic book. Two skew cylinder shafts are flinging energy pegs at you. Nope. Nope. You look inside the comic book, it's a hideous android is running into school with toast in its mouth. Seems like it's late. So I guess she just studies humans? Pink goop drops with this strange machine. Ew, what is that? Is that... Can I have this chainsaw? Hmm, can I read that? Can I have this? The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Do Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. There's a lamp with pink fish on the lampshade. There are no light there's no light bulb. Can I give you one? An incredible invention, but not in use. This bed falls into an extremely easy to draw box. Nice. What's about this poster? There's a promo poster for Metatron's TV premiere. On a flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. Well, that's nice of it. Okay, so this is her lab. Wait, before I go outside the lab, I guess? I'm going to go this way, because there was something down there. Oh wait, I already went this way. Sorry guys, like I said, I have a memory of like a 90 year old woman sometimes. So we're meeting- so we made Alphys. Alphys. However you say it. Can I go in the bathroom now? Where does she go? She, is she up here now? We Nope, she's just gone. Alright. That's some um, decent. Alright. Very cool. Alpha has updated her status. Just realized I didn't watch Undyne I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Oh, we're gonna like what you see. Alpha is well I know she's unbeatable, I'll ask her about it later. Hmm, she looked pretty beatable. For now I just gotta call up the human and guide them. She has kitty she's so she's a social media star, I guess. Let's see. Let's go up. What's just happened? Vulcan strokes strolls in. Vulcan attack 25, defense 0. Mistakenly believes in Slava can heal people. Oh no. Fender, helpful, speed up. Oh my god. Nope. No, 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 no. That's not good. No, 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 no. Uh, can I criticize it? That its attacks are not helpful. Ah, not helpful. It, it, its attacks become extreme. Does, does my best. Um. Oh, what is this? I don't. Oh. Oh. Ouch. Oh my. What? Is, what are these? Can I hug it? No. No. I meant to encourage it. Okay. There we go. I meant to give it a hug, but I guess I went over to criticize. Can I hug it? Ow. Okay, that was a mistake. Nope. Oh, uh, sir, madam, madam, uh, sir, madam. Come on, just spare you. <laughs> Bye. Part of me is telling me that I should really start fighting things up. I'm gonna call them in a minute. Yeah, you do that. Let's see, this way. Ooh, that looks weird. Let's see. The whooshing sound of steam and cogs, it fills you with determination. I'll save this. And I'm going to go ahead and end up on this, uh, on this episode. I mean, on this note. Um, I don't think we did too much. We just got through the Alphys fight. And we, I mean, not the Alphys fight. The um, Undyne and the Metaton fight. I'm assuming that we're going to do Metaton a little bit more. Shondere <sighs> plane gets in the way. Not on purpose or anything. 
Sonary plane attack, 25 defense, 26. Seems mean, but does it secretly like you? No way! Why do I like you? Okay, I'll just beat you up then. Don't be a bitch about it. Uh, ooh. That's not what it does. I'm just gonna... Get out of here. Hm! <laughs> Don't get in my way! You're just dropping grenades in here! What the fuck is this? Russia shit! No! Bumps you with the swing. Ugh. Fucking... Get out of here. But, I never got to... Oh, wow! What the hell was that? Hey, we gotta level up. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm gonna end off here. I'm sorry if it's a short episode, but I think I, that won't be a problem with the next episode. Because it seems like a lot of people... I hate using a phone. I don't want to use this. I don't want to use this at all. Okay. The next episode, we'll we'll find out. We'll find out what to do now. Next episode. I already said that. Um. Thank you for watching Undertale. Uh, next episode goes in whichever day. Monday, Wednesday, Friday. So, okay. <laughs> I lost train of thought. My bad. Um. Bye, guys. Thank you so much for helping me out.